The programme that I've taken part in uh, involved getting a group of uh, police officers and young people together um, to work with them to try and break down barriers, uh, get both sides to understand uh, where the other sides were coming from and that was done by um, arranging them to meet face to face over several sessions, um, all managed by the restorative justice team. This project is a six month body of work that was commissioned by the Northamptonshire Police and Crime Commissioner to bring together police and young people using a mixture of restorative approaches, theatre games and coaching exercises. We've done eight sessions, we've brought 60 police officers and 60 young people together and it's been a fantastic body of work that's worked over the whole county and had ripple effects with much wider reaching consequences. So what I would like to know is what you thought about the police before you did the, se the session. What was your attitude towards them? I didn't like them. I didn't like them. <laughs> at all? <laughs> at all? No. Did it shift at all doing the work that you did? Yeah, I mean it changed my um, perspective of them like completely. I think they're, what do you think, yeah? Yeah, it changed my opinion completely on them. Like they're not all the same. We're just talking to them one on one, yeah, yeah. about our experiences. <clears throat> like they understood like, a lot. Mm. Which I didn't feel what they were going to. Do you want to talk about the game a bit? Oh, yeah. the, well, the police officers were well funny in there. It's got everyone involved. <laughs> yeah, they got the everyone officers. involved. Like, every, like, 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 it just seemed like they weren't even police officers, just like normal people. Just one of us. Yeah, just, like, it's, they're acting like young kids and everything. He decided to become a police officer because he, he thought it was really interesting and like the different types of like, oh, like the diversity of it all. Like, you don't really, you're not doing the same thing. Like, <coughs> I came and met you in your house yeah. and uh, had a chat with you. And how would you say your attitude towards the police was at that time? Atrocious. <laughs> very, very negative, yeah, not gonna lie. <laughs> and do you think it has shifted? Yes. Yeah, a little bit, yeah. And what do you think has caused it to shift? Actually talking to them and getting their opinions and things and like they're explaining things a lot better to the youth and then just doing what they need to do in their job. So do you think that in normal policing, if explanations were made better, it would make relationships better? Yes. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I think for myself and other officers, uh, we found the programme to be uh, beneficial, uh, to be very positive. Um, the things that came out of the sessions um, uh, from the young people, being us to believe that they um, saw it as the same. Um, quite a few of them have said that they don't see police officers now as just being um, a person in uniform behind a badge, but that we're all uh, like themselves, individuals. Um, we have a job to do, but we're all individuals um, with our own set of agenda, and um, hopefully uh, both sides can continue to see that in the future and we can um, spread the process that started um, here this last couple of weeks.